and welcome to our first lesson. In this lesson you will learn about the German alphabet and the basic rules of pronunciation. Let's start. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V V X Y Z Learn some German words. Well done. Let's start with the first letter. A A Please repeat after me. A The letter A is pronounced like the A in the word astronaut and in the longer version it sounds like the a in the word far your first german word is apfel apfel which means apple let's continue with b b which is pronounced like the b in the word banana and the translation of banana is in German banana banana let's have a look at the letter C C which is pronounced like the C in the word ice in the German language, the words which normally start with the letter C is pronounced like the letter K. Here we have the word chor, chor, which means choir. D, D, D sounds like the D in the word doll. Here we have the example of the word Deutschland. Deutschland, which means Germany. Now let's have a look at the letter E. E, which is pronounced like the E in the word ten. The German word with the letter E is Elefant. Elefant, which means elephant. F. F. F is pronounced like the word fish and the translation of fish in German is the same fish fish the next letter is G G G is pronounced like the G in the word go and the German word is Giraffe Giraffe which means giraffe as you can see, the word giraffe is written exactly the same way as in English, but the pronunciation is completely different. G, giraffe. Ha, ha is pronounced like the word haus, and the German translation for house is haus. That's pretty easy. Haus. The next letter is E, E, which is pronounced like in the short form it, it. In the longer version, it's pronounced like the E in the word easy, easy. The German word with the letter E is Eagle, 
Eagle, which means hedgehog. Yacht. Yacht. The letter yacht is pronounced like the Y in the word yogurt. The German translation for yogurt is yogurt. Yogurt. Ka. Ka is pronounced like the K in the word king. The German word is Kino. Kino, which means cinema. The next letter is L. L. L is pronounced like the L in the word love, and the translation for love in German is Liebe. Liebe. M. M. Is pronounced like the M in the word man, and the translation for man in German is Mann. Mann. N. N. Is pronounced like the N in the word night, and the translation for night in German is Nacht. Nacht. O. O. Is pronounced like orange, and the translation for orange in German is orange, orange. Now let's continue with p, p, which is pronounced like the word party. The translation for party in German is party, party. k. Q, which is pronounced like the Q in the word quiz. The translation for the word quiz is similar. In German, we say quiz as well. Quiz. R, R. For this letter, there is no equivalent in English. In order to pronounce this letter right, you have to gargle in the back of your throat until it starts to vibrate. R, R. Now try. That is how we officially pronounce the German R, but in some region in Germany, we also use the Spanish R. And the German word with the letter R is rot, rot. Which means red. S, S is pronounced like the sun. The translation for sun in German is Sonne, Sonne. T, T is pronounced like the T in the word T, and the German translation for T is T. T. U. U is pronounced like the word U. The German word with the letter U is U. U, which means clock. V. V is pronounced like the F in the word for. In German, we have the word Vogel. Vogel, which means bird. The next one is V, V, which sounds like the V in the word van. The German word with the letter V is Wasser, Wasser, which means water. The next letter is X, X. Which is pronounced like the X in the word xylophone. The German translation for xylophone is very similar. In German, we say xylophone, xylophone. The next letter is y, y, which sounds like yoga. In the German language, we don't have that many words. Starting with the letter y, but we also have the same word, yoga, 
yoga. And the last letter is Z. Z, which is pronounced like the S in the word bits. Here we have the example of the word so, so, which means zoo. Now let's review what you just learned. You learned the 26 letters of the German alphabet and also 26 words. You also learned that there is no equivalent for the letter R and that the letter V in German sounds like F in English and that the letter W in German sounds like the V in English. Now let's have a look at the special letters called Umlaute. There are exactly three of them. The first one looks like this. It's an A with a double dot above the A. We call it Ä, Ä or A Umlaut. A Umlaut. A Umlaut is pronounced like the E in the word melon or in the A of the word H. The second Umlaut is Ö. Ö or O umlaut. Ö is pronounced like the word flirt or the word girl. The last umlaut is Ü. Ü or U umlaut. For this letter, there is no equivalent in English. There is one more special letter in the German alphabet which looks like this. We call it SZ. SZ or scharfes S. Scharfes S, which means a sharp S. This letter is pronounced like the double S in the word kiss. And always remember this letter SZ is the only letter that will never be at the beginning of a word. Now let's review what you just learned. You learned that altogether there are 30 letters in a German alphabet and that the extra letters are Ä, Ö, Ü and SZ. And you also learned that SZ is the only letter that will never be at the beginning of a word. This was our first lesson. See you in the next lesson where we'll learn about different letter combinations and how to pronounce them right.